What is up guys? Welcome back to the Lumsden Motorsports Garage. I'm Wade Lumsden and it is race day. Uh, dirt track championship morning of. So I uh, got to get the car cleared off and uh, tires put back on it. Change the, the differential fluid in the rear end. Um, I'm going to do that when it's on the ground. And uh, yeah, I'm hoping today goes nice and smooth. I'd already... Okay, first thing this morning, I broke a shoelace. Not that you guys really, really care, but it broke off like right here. I had to like backtrack the shoelace to have enough shoelace to tie my shoe. And I'm hoping that's not like, uh, I don't know. Um, I hope that's not foreshadowing of <laughs> the way the rest of the weekend's gonna go. Anyways, uh, yeah, gonna start working on getting loaded up and uh, Rock and roll, so let's get to work. Alrighty guys, we made it. Um, we're at the track, actually been here for a while. I've uh, been doing some uh, uh, volunteer stuff, but uh, cars unloaded. Uh, we changed the rear tires. Uh, what else? Oh, we checked the, the leak on them brake lines. Uh, I had somebody help. I had Mickey helping me out. Um, and uh, he, uh, I was in the car pumping the brakes and he was checking them for leaks. And um, we got everything tightened up. Nothing's leaking. So we should be good there. Uh, didn't have to actually change them gonna be running double duty tonight uh gonna run glenn lee's uh bootlegger as well as the modified um we already got topped off with fuel now i gotta do tire pressures what up <laughs> now i gotta do tire pressures and uh the modified should be good to go uh they're getting ready to do hot laps now so i'm gonna get changed and um yeah do we do a do we do a before round? See what the see what happens. Uh, we don't have lineups yet, so I have no idea where we're starting. They're supposed to get lineups up after the hot laps are are done. Uh, we still had drivers coming in and signing in, which was changing things like crazy. Um, I know we were supposed to start racing at five, which is not a normal time for us to start racing. Uh, usually we start racing at six, so. Um, people are, are still rolling in and we're like oh you know so <laughs> uh, oh well here's what it is uh, we'll get uh, we'll get all prepped and get rocking and rolling here so all right uh, just did my hot laps on the modified um, felt okay uh, I don't know I got into the slick spot there's a slick spot in one and two and I kept hitting it um, and I only had two laps so I hit it twice I guess um, Headed up to sing the National Anthem. Whoop, watch out, bud. Hey. hey. Number 81 bootlegger should be a good night of racing. 
Hey, thanks for the GoPro. Oh, <laughs> it's actually actually the same one that I've got. I've got the, the hero. Nine. I've got the nine and I've got the hero. Got right nice. back for you. Yeah, yeah. All right, so uh, just finished with the national anthem. Uh, we're headed down to. I say we're. Say what's up. What's up, guys? <laughs> he was nice enough to uh, record the national anthem for me. Um, I figured I'd give him a lift. You know. What do you think? Yeah. Uh, okay. And he's wearing a nice shirt. Check that shirt out. Look at that. Comfy shirt. I'll wear it all week. That's it. <laughs> um, we're gonna stop by, check out what the lineup looks like. Uh, whew, this day is getting crazy. Let's take a look here. Let's take a look. Well, we are in the bootleggers. Bootleggers run fourth. Oh, oh, get off the quad. Yes. All right, let's see. Let's see. Okay, bootleggers run fourth. I'm in the first heat of the bootleggers, second. Awesome. Uh, in the modifieds, I am in the back. And modifieds run last, so got a little bit of time. So I don't think I told you guys, but I, uh, before I got to leave the house, I had to jump start my truck because I had it out in the street. Had it out in the street with the flashers on. And, uh, well, apparently I had it out in the street with the flashers on for too long because the battery was dead. So I had to, that battery I just swapped out. <laughs> um, I didn't swap it. All I did was have to pull out that deep cycle battery and jump start to it. But, you know, I just, I'm hoping that was all the frustration that I was gonna get because I am ready. I'm ready to have a really good race weekend, a really good race night. Whew, let's have some fun. Uh, so first up for me is gonna be the bootlegger. Uh, I'm gonna get the camera mounted up and ready to go. And then I'm gonna run around and get some cars to line up.
more out of the car. I was blowing my tires off coming out of the corner so I wasn't getting the bike off the corner that I needed. Okay. Um, did quick recap. Um, second in the bootlegger. I uh, made the redraw. Uh, or, yeah, made the redraw. Uh, pulled a one, so we're going to start on the pull. That's awesome. Uh, modified. I went out there, started uh, fifth, finished fourth. Um, I don't know. Felt like, felt like I could have been there, but I ended up hitting a hole and it just completely upset the car. And I thought I broke something, but it's all right. You know, things happen. Everything was good. Um, I just. I don't know, I'm trying to track down my brother now. I kind of need an outside opinion as to what he thought the car was doing. I'm going to compare that to what I thought the car was doing. Uh, see if I can make some changes. So, uh, he's up here with a cheeseburger in his hand. I see him. Oh, oh, oh. But, um, it was going good. And uh, we're going to... So, miss the redraw for the, the modifieds. I should probably start in the fourth row i don't know if it'll be inside or outside i was looking for you and i was like oh he's got a burger no he's got pulled pork i got pulled pork dude and a corn dog and a corn dog yep or one of those for me nope absolutely i had to not. actually cook this myself oh yeah Vol <laughs> the life of a volunteer yeah. <laughs> that's what we do right <laughs> all right i'll come back to you guys soon all righty so bootlegger for the first time it's a money show, so it's not point stuff. Uh, we starting on the pill. That's awesome. And then for the modified, uh, we are starting outside. Outside, fourth row. Boom. And we're running the 81 here. Just as a reminder. <laughs> so, yeah, this will be good. You ready? I'm ready. All right. <laughs> out that race uh, Bob is back in the flag stand that same way over there so uh, he's good to go but um, whew, I think uh, I'm not 100% sure but I think if I'm not next I'm right after that so it actually knocked his eye out and socked him. oh it hit him so hard I'm trying to talk to you it hit him so hard it knocked his eye out of his socket so um, it was pretty bad but He's a trooper, he's back in there, so let's get back to racing. <clears throat> Alright, so I know the bootleggers, what I'm running next, I actually got, I mean, there's lots of excitement going out there on the track. I uh, just got off the flag stand, not sure if you guys caught all that, I'm hoping you did. Um, but, I'm uh, uh, going to do some tire prep here, I'm uh, going to grind some tires, uh, but I also, I don't know, I think my car keeps tracking towards the wall um, so I might take some trail out of this side um, out of the right side so I haven't made up my mind 100% on that decision yet but uh, yeah I at least got to get it jacked up get the tires off so I can start grinding okay got one tire ground uh, mixed with uh, shorten up my trail just a little bit on the right rear hoping that'll help me i still got one more tire to do but i gotta go get in the bootlegger um 
and I still got to put fuel in this thing and do tire pressure. So hopefully after the bootleggers, um, I'll have time to do that. But starting on the pole, fingers crossed that we have some good luck.
just keep continuing here. Um, broke the track bar again on the bootlegger there, so uh, cut our race short. Um, here, getting the modified ready to go, and uh, my compressor let the smoke out, so it's it's burned up and done. So that's awesome. <laughs> oh my goodness! It's not one thing; it's another. Always is. So. All right, getting ready to crawl into the modified and go do the main event.
update on the night <clears throat> did not go well for me uh, yeah look at that look at that nicely repaired bumper <laughs> all, all smashed over dang it jeez uh, well nose is all messed up so definitely got some body work to do um you saw there at the end i got i got uh cut down on and, um and spun and then i got i took a pretty big shot to the driver's door but i'm extremely shocked here um i'm not seeing a whole lot of whole lot of damage or anything um I honestly, I started taking my gloves and stuff off after the hit because I figured stuff was broke um, and it didn't. Uh, it turns out that I was still good to drive. So, um, yeah, I mean, we, we took some damage. I don't know. That was a really interesting track. Um, there was moisture and, and grip in the corners. Um, there was a big hole in one in turn one if you hit that it just completely upset the car um, and uh, it was weird because there was grip in the corners but then you're coming out of coming out of the straightaway and then halfway down the straightaway it was slick like like super slick and all of a sudden all of a sudden it was just like hit nice like um, rpms would go up rear end would jack out um, it was it was, it was interesting it was um, kind of tough to drive but uh, I mean I had fun I'm a little upset I kept I kept getting pinched um, down into the infield but I, I don't I don't really like dooring people so I you know I got on the brakes I guess oh well here's what it is I have no idea where I finished uh, car did drive itself around a couple couple more laps and into the pits so um, I'm happy with that uh, for the modified I guess um, we live to race tomorrow it looks like just cosmetic stuff so um, bootlegger you know kind of the the same old story um, trying to trying to pass somebody and then I get hit uh, we make contact and it breaks that track par again. Um, that thing is just so fragile. <laughs> so fragile, man. Um, so, that, I mean, that kind of stinks. Uh, I feel like we had a good car. Um, especially there towards the end of my race. It wasn't really the end of the race, but the end of my race. Um, I felt like we were, we were gaining more speed as the track dried out a little bit more. Um, but oh well, you know, is what it is. Um, again, that's why they call it racing and not winning. Uh, but uh, came into the pits, got out of the car. Oh man! And there were hi puppy dog. There's a big puppy dog coming over here. I'm. Uh... <laughs> Are you you looking for your owners? There's, there's nothing in there for you, bud. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, yeah, get out of the car and then over yonder, way over there, there was a bunch of a bunch of craziness going on. I'm not, I have no idea what happened. Um, something that happened, I don't know. Something that happened in the in the bootlegger race with another driver and something that happened with it just so happened to be the modified driver that was pit right next to that bootlegger um i don't know there was crazy stuff i think there was like a, well, there was an actual fight or something going on up there i don't know um no idea i missed all of it it's just kind of the way it goes um anyways <laughs> <laughs> Always exciting. There's a sheriff up there now, so we'll, uh, I guess we'll see where that goes. Um, anyways, yeah. It was kind of a omen, I guess. Uh, the day started with issues with my shoelaces. 
And then we had the truck die and I had to jump start the truck. And then I get here. Um, and then things were actually, you know, going, going decent, I thought, you know. And then right before the, the modified race, my air compressor gave up the ghost, let the smoke out, literally let the smoke out. <laughs> Big old poof of smoke. Um, <laughs> you got, you gotta be kidding me. So, uh, that kind of stinks, but oh well, oh well. We live to fight another day. That sh I'm a little sore after that shot to the door, but I'm good. Um, safety equipment all did its job um, properly, and I'm, I'm, I was good right after, right after it happened. So. <sighs> With that, um, I got just a little bit of cleanup to do here. Uh, I'm gonna have to come back and hit it hard in the morning. Um, and I, I guess we got some panels to straighten out. We definitely got a nose and a bumper to swap. Here's my bumper. So I don't know if you guys remember last race, I messed up that bumper, right? That one. And I was telling you how I've been carrying a spare in the trailer since March, since Bristol, basically. And, uh, man, look at this hair. Um, <clears throat> been carrying a spare since Bristol. Never needed it. I loaned it to uh, um, Rusty here, uh, one of another, dri another driver here, uh, to put on his sport mod. And uh, sure, sure enough, you know, the next race, that I trashed the bumper, right? Um, it's just how it goes whatever uh, so, um, we patched the bumper together in previous videos right and this bumper's trashed again but thankfully rusty had ordered a bumper to replace the one that um, uh, I lent him and here it is boom so we have a bumper for tomorrow we'll fix do some nose tweaking oh man Lots of nose tweaking. Whew. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> lots, lots and lots of nose tweaking. Uh, and uh, hit it hard tomorrow. So I'm going to finish uh, cleaning up here a little bit and, uh, and call it a night. So uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, any questions, comments, concerns down below. I'm sorry if we missed any race footage. I was having issues with the GoPro. I kept having to, like right before the modified race started, I had to like yank it out, pull the battery out, put it back in. It was, and I was in the seat. I had to have somebody else like yank it out of the case and, and help me with that. So, um, but so I'm sorry if you missed anything, but like, subscribe, questions, comments, concerns down below. Lumsden Motorsports Facebook page. Uh, reach out to me if you want a t-shirt and uh, yeah we'll see you guys uh, see you guys in the next video thanks for watching